Okay, so I think it's worse than I thought. I I thought we had spent ten trillion dollars uh, in just <laughs> you know in just trillion. Those... That's it. That's ridiculous. all you. Ridiculous. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Only so let's trillion. go back in one year. Now, remember, our total debt, our total debt from George Washington to George W. Bush, the end of George W. Bush was eight trillion dollars. OK, that's the Manhattan Project. That's the, all the wars. It's everything. In fact, all of the wars themselves, including the Manhattan Project, World War One, World War Two, the Civil War, the Revolutionary War, the Spanish American War, the Vietnam, Korea, uh, the Gulf Wars, all of those combined in today's dollars. So inflation adjusted. All of that cost you and me seven trillion dollars. OK, well, every war, every warship, everything seven trillion trillion dollars and that's not how much it costs that was the debt accumulated uh, over that time right that's i mean obviously we spent more than that um yes yeah, seven tr- seven trillion right. seven trillion dollars right. we have spent 20 trillion dollars on the great society okay so okay since 1965 20 trillion dollars since 1965 so let me take you back in time a little bit here this is going to mm-hmm. pat gray joins us by the way from pat gray unleashed on blaze tv and blaze radio networks uh let me take you back to early March 2020. They're starting to come up. There's a little bubbling about the coronavirus. Things are going on. People are like asking questions. Mm. And the initial response, they pass an $8.3 billion bill to fight the coronavirus. <laughs> wow, uh, $8.3 billion. By the way, we're going to have an $8.3 billion bill. You'll be able to keep it in your wallet <laughs> uh, very soon. But anyway, okay. I, I read that. It was actually, it was almost charming. Like, it's like, it was. A, like a small oh. town. Oh, remember $8 billion oh, dollar bills? Cute. Remember oh. those? Yeah, adorable. Okay. So, yeah. so, so wait, wait, wait. Just so you know, that was, that was the first spending. Tonight, he is asking for $80 billion just to be able to make sure that we can audit everybody that we want to audit yes. in the IRS. <laughs> just okay. so we can take more Eight, money from the people. Right. Eight Jeez. billion for the first stimulus package or the first COVID relief package. Eight billion. Eighty is proposed just as an increase for the auditors at the uh, at the IRS. Mm. OK, go ahead. So then a few days later, March 18th, 2020, we passed the uh, family first coronavirus response act that was 192 mm-hmm. billion dollars people mm-hmm. i mean it's hard to even remember this happened coronavirus mm-hmm. uh the cares act uh, the cares act was march 27th so nine days later they passed a two trillion dollar cares act which was unheard of never been done in american history and that passed. a year ago never been done in human history and you might say, wow, right. $2 trillion. It must have been a long time since the, until they passed another act, right? That would be crazy. Right. That's right. why on April 24th, 2020, <laughs> they passed another $483 billion bill. Yeah, but that was days after. Yeah. That was weeks. You're talking days. Uh, weeks. Weeks. Yeah. 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 Yeah, 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 yeah. And it still wasn't enough. Remember, it still wasn't enough. Right. Now, then we got into the election time. Really, nothing was passed in, in hardcore Correct. election time. We got then got to uh, the elections over. It's December 27th, 2020. Then we pass another $868 billion bill. The Consolidated Appropriations Act of the 2021, which is one of the catchiest names. Yeah, I've right, ever heard. Right. Okay. And it's under. A so trillion. that was the one that was the one where you're all going to everybody's going to get money and it's going to be great. And that's mm-hmm. why you have to vote for Democrats, because uh, we have eight hundred and sixty eight billion dollars. Uh, just, so, just minor correction there, Glenn. That was the one after the election was already over. So that one they, they had already. Uh, no, but no, no, no. Remember, it was used for Atlanta, for Georgia. Mm hmm. True. They were making right, they want, yes, okay, I see what you're saying. Yeah, yes, yeah, they yeah, wanted yeah, two thousand yeah, yeah. dollars instead of the whatever it was six hundred dollars they put in that bill. That was mm-hmm. you're, you're correct. Mm-hmm. Yeah, sorry about that. So that's a total of five point three three five billion dollars in that five point three three five. Now we haven't. Hey, that's that. We, I should. That's that's what we spent last year under Donald Trump. Yeah, we haven't last even gotten year. to Biden yet. <laughs> <laughs> Got it. Okay. Wait so, until you hear this. Now then, mm-hmm. Biden uh, has the uh, $1.9 trillion American Rescue Plan, which was enacted on mm-hmm. March 11th, 2021. So mm-hmm. then we have... Uh, so, t- by, by the way, that is only the... 
That's the only the second time the United States or any humans ever got together and said, let's spend two trillion dollars. Mm-hmm. Only the second time. The first time it happened was a year ago. Then this year they decided to do it again. And, mm-hmm. you know, typical okay. Pat, typical Glenn Beck uh, exaggerations. It's, it was only a one point nine trillion dollar bill. Yeah. Yeah. Not yeah, two trillion. Right. Yeah. Two trillion yeah. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah. And really, what's a hundred billion between friends? <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh yeah so uh then we have the american rescue plan that was enacted uh on march 11th that was 1.9 trillion we have uh tonight he's pitching another 1.8 trillion dollars now then, this is different yeah. that's different than the 2.2 that is already in the pipeline right which is the infrastructure bill different totally Correct. different that's four Correct. trillion dollars okay. completely unrelated to what we're talking about then there was it's s- actually four it's actually it's 4.1 that he's doing tonight isn't it something like that yeah it's a little over four yeah, it's, I, think, I think technically it's, so it's 4.1 just tonight hmm. okay then there was so uh, a, a million a trillion so dollars of administration uh, administrative uh, cost associated with this well then paper. there was I the mean, federal no printing paper <laughs> right the federal reserve lending now that is another large you didn't see a lot of bills about that, but there was an additional no. six trillion dollars there. Wait, what? Six okay. trillion? Six trillion? Six trillion? Just the six, six trillion, trillion, though, not twenty trillion. And what was that for? Uh, Federal Reserve. Uh, that was lending? to. Yeah, that was to bail out the big banks. Uh, remember when I said a year ago? So nobody's hey, added that up, is, though for us, right? In a news story, nobody's nobody's talking about that. There are some six stories who talk about it. Yeah, yeah. but that yeah, is. Yeah, we've talked about it. Yeah, but, wow. but nobody's done this. Nobody's done this. So since the coronavirus, our entire national debt that it, that took us from George Washington to today is twenty eight trillion dollars. In the last year, we have spent nineteen point five trillion dollars. I don't think there's a problem. Oh, my gosh. Do you remember when the national debt clock was wow. around 11 uh-huh. and it was it was about to be a break even 10 when we lived in New York and it was such a big deal. Oh, my gosh. We've doubled it. Almost damn near doubled it. In a in year. A year. Oh. Where's all that money? Seriously, people wow. don't have a concept wow. of how much a trillion dollars is. Okay, we, we don't have a concept. A trillion dollars should change the world. And I have news for you. I think it is. I think it is. Hmm. All of this money that is going out, who's paying attention? How much money is lost in, in just the accounting of $19 trillion? How much money is going to something that Mm. we have no idea and would not be for? I I mean, this is this is the biggest theft in all of human history. And tonight he's going to be proposing the four trillion that will take us up to the nineteen point five trillion dollars in debt. You know, you think about Uh, just just, new debt. You think about one trillion dollars. Uh, just to put that into context, a trillion seconds ago, one trillion seconds ago was 38, uh, 31,688 years ago. Jeez. A trillion seconds oh is 31,688 years. Just, it kind of puts it into perspective a little bit. Uh, it's a gigantic number gigantic you could spend a million dollars a day i rem- i don't remember exactly the statistic but it's something like you could spend a million dollars a day from the time of christ until now and yes. you wouldn't have spent a trillion dollars now think of this think of this Jeez. you might say that would be easy but let's just say you want to do good and change the world and your job is to spend a million dollars a day every day you have 24 hours to spend a million dollars it'd be hard to do okay it would be really hard to do now imagine that you had 19 trillion dollars to spend 
in a, in a year. Jeez. What size team would you need to make sure that that money was well spent? How, what kind of team would you need just to dream the things up? You know, they're saying that this is going to be the the moonshot. Um, you know, we're going to do this in 10 years and return a man safely, you know, back to Earth. The JFK moonshot thing, except tell me what we have at the end of it. Tell me what we're going to be like in 10 years. They're going to say, and we will have we will have begun to change the 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 global warming thing, but it won't be enough. It's not enough. So we're going to in 10 years, we're still going to be having the same argument about global warming. Same argument, because this is a scam. That what this is, is about fundamental transformation of the United States, of our economy, of of our education, of our communication, of absolutely everything. And we're sitting at home, not not you most likely, but many people are sitting at home and they're just lapping up the free money. I mean, this is the time that uh, Franklin spoke about when the politicians figure out they can just spend all kinds of cash and just give it to people. the, The elections won't matter anymore. The Republic will be over. Hmm. Who are we giving this money to? 19 trillion, 19 trillion dollars. Is there, I mean, I think this is the problem. You just said it, Stu. Eight billion seems quaint. Hmm. We don't even bat an eyelash at a billion anymore. We don't even, that doesn't even sound like a lot. No. And, and, uh, you know, a hundred billion dollars is a lot of money. It's mm-hmm. a lot of money. Let's let's it's a lot of money. A hundred billion dollars. They need that to be able to hire a few people to be able to uh, do audits on Americans. That's that's the IRS needs 80 billion dollars to hire people to do audits at the IRS, that seems unreasonable. Is it just me? Now, I know these are union jobs, so I don't know what the hourly scale is, but it seems a little out of whack. And that's not me. That's from the guy who used to run the IRS for Obama and Trump said, you can't spend that much money. I don't know how you're going to do it. It's incredible. Another one of these uh, million, billion, trillion dollar things is from Brian Riedel. A million dollar program costs just under a penny per household. A billion dollar program costs eight dollars per household. A trillion dollar program costs eight thousand dollars per household. (laughs) So we're talking about. Oh, my God. So tonight he's putting thirty two thousand dollars per household will be proposed just this evening. Jeez. People just don't have any clue. And there's just no way you're we're being made slaves of this debt. We're we're enslaved to China or whoever else wants to tell us what to do, because I mean, who we owe our money to, you know, who we owe this money to the Fed. Mm -hmm. And you know what the Fed is? The five biggest banks, the five biggest banks will own everything in America because they're Mm -hmm. the ones writing all the loans. It's obscene what's happening. You know how much $1 trillion bills would weigh? <laughs> how much? <laughs> this is incredible no, to me. Much. Okay, so you just have $1 trillion, $1 mm-hmm. bills. Mm-hmm. 2.2 billion pounds. <laughs> oh, my gosh. It's oh my gosh. It's approaching Jeffy territory. Yes, there. it is. It's almost. Uh, that's why we need a trillion-dollar bill, and we will most likely get it very, very soon. <laughs> 